I'm at the doctor's office for the first time, my primary care doctor. So it's been since I was 18 years old since I've been to a primary care. So I'm finally going to one. Now I can actually get referrals out to my, my neurosurgeon and get everything established with my back and my spine and my head. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see what they say about my checkup. All right, guys. So the appointment went really well. First off, I'm going to start by with my high blood pressure. So I used to be taking Procardia, um, 60 milligrams, and the side effects are major headaches, um, which I have been getting ever since I've been taking it. Um, it has been getting worse since after pregnancy and the headaches would literally last me all freaking day and i just will feel miserable so i told the doctor that and she's prescribing me with this other medication that i can take um and this medication you can't take during pregnancy so thank god i'm not pregnant anymore um and um so I'll be able to take this medication. She says she's gonna start off with a low dose um, and see how it see how it goes. She wants me to um, check my blood pressures um, every day um, until the follow up appointments, and I have a log for that. Um, also, I'm getting a referral out to the neurosurgeon for my spina bifida um, because I haven't seen a neurosurgeon since 17, 18 years old and I really need to do um, more MRIs done on my back to make sure the tissue um, is not growing and it's staying its place. Um, so I have that to, to take care of. And then I also, um, they're going to be running some ultrasounds on my thyroid because thyroid runs in my family. My brother has thyroid. So, and um, when I was in the hospital and I had a CT scan because I was having so much pain, like I couldn't lay down, like I thought it was gas pains, but they noticed something with my thyroid. Um, they said nothing to be concerned about, but something to look into in the future. So she's going to do ultrasounds, have me do ultrasounds, blood work done. Um, and also um, the labs, she's going to do a whole uh, lab um, thing for me, a lab order thing um, to check all my anemic, um, my iron, I should say, and my thyroid to make sure everything is up to par. Um, I believe that's it. Um, neurosurgeon, ultrasounds for the thyroid, uh, labs done, and yeah, that's about it. So we'll see how everything goes with the labs. I have to fast for my labs, um, and then I have to follow up in three weeks. And we'll see how everything turns out to be. Um, I'm really hoping uh, this blood pressure medication, the new one, will work out best because I just hate feeling miserable. So let's hope for that. All right, guys. So a little bit earlier today before my doctor's appointment, I went a little bit of shopping. I went to Burlington and when I went to Bath Body Works because David needed some cologne. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Burlington. Oh, and I also went to Kohl's too. Um, so yeah, let me show you guys what I got from Burlington first. I got Easton, a pair of pajamas, the Nikes, it's a three month. Got it for $8.99. Here's another outfit for Easton. Super cute. I got this for $7.99. I 
because he needs a lot of sleepers, so I've been getting a lot of sleepers. Look how cute this is. Got this for $5.99. Here's another sleeper, zero to three, or four forty nine. Another sleeper, dinosaur. And then got this for him, a moose. Got this for uh. I got this because it reminds me of Sherry. Sherry loves mooses, so I got this because she loves it. And this is a uh, three to six. And then I got two things for Hayden because he really needs more clothes. So I try to get more clothes for him, especially shirts. Like he has lots of shorts. He just needs a lot more shirts because he's outgrowing all the other shirts. So I got him this shirt. Isn't this so cute for Hayden for $3.99 and then also for this one for Hayden best brother and this one was actually $3.99 so I think Hayden's gonna like it um he is just a growing boy he is super tall so now he's into like 5t 5t shirts um he's just such a growing boy. And then what I got from Kohl's is I needed his, I need a new pair of jeans. A new pair of jeans for myself. I love the brand Wallflower. I love the brand. And then I got a pair of shorts for Weston because he needs more shorts too. Um, he's outgrowing all of his shorts and all the shorts are going to Winston. So he's going to need more shorts. So I got him some more gym shorts. And then I got Easton a, um, a nice outfit for picture day on March 7th. Um, so hopefully this will match the other kids when they have their pitch picture done at the school so I got that for him and then for Bath Body Works <clears throat> I got David um, the Ocean Cologne this is his favorite brand is Ocean from there and then three hand sanitizers one is Beautiful Day the other one is Rose Water Ivy and then this one is the Japanese Cherry Blossom that's what I've gotten so that's all I got. So we are here at the pediatrician for his two month checkup. And he weighs 11 pounds, one ounce. Yes, you're getting so big. You're getting so big. <laughs> yeah. So I think he's going to have shots today. I'm not sure. But yeah. It's been already a hectic Monday already. Yeah. And he's getting hungry. As you can tell, he's sucking on his fingers. So I'm on my way to drop off Ethan at the daycare. He has three shots today. <coughs> and um, he did pretty good. Um, I know he did cry because you know babies cry when they have shots but he did overall good with the shots he actually calmed down after a couple seconds of the shot and that's about it so <coughs> and now a little later on I got an ultrasound appointment for my thyroid how fun So I just got done with the ultrasound appointment. It was very easy peasy, very quick thing. And I'm trying to take off all these hairs off my necklace because I had to take off my necklace while doing the ultrasound. So hopefully everything turns out good with my thyroid. I don't want to have any problems with my thyroid. I know it runs in my mom's family, so I'm really hoping I don't have any problems with it because that would be bad. I don't need 
another thing of medication to look out for. So hopefully we will find out the results soon. All right guys, so I'm on my way to my doctor's appointments to discuss about my results for my thyroid. So we'll see what happens. I did not end up doing the blood, what's the blood labs because um, I just haven't had the time to do so. So I'm gonna have to do it after this appointment because you have to like fast and stuff. So um, I'll just have to do it another day. But my main my main concern was just my thyroid. I'm not concerned about like all my other health issues. Well, not health issues, but you know. <laughs> just to make sure all my um, everything is good with my blood and stuff but I'm just more concerned with, with my thyroid so I'm hoping everything is good so we will find out just waiting on the doctor now to go over the results all right just got done with the appointments so basically um, they looked at she looked at the results and there's nothing major with my thyroid they they did see a, like a module a nodule I think, a nodule in my right um, there was one with a cyst and then the other one was just small but solid and they're just going to just have you know uh, follow up with that in a year to see to make sure that it hasn't grown or um yeah so they're just gonna follow up on that in a year just to make sure everything is good with that so other than that everything is good she did put me on a different medication for my blood pressure because the blood pressure that she did put me on had a side effect of um lots of coughing and um heavy chest so she's gonna put me on this other medication that's kind of similar but it doesn't have really any side effects so we're gonna try that and see how that works so um i'm about to head home so i hope you guys enjoy this video um don't forget to like subscribe and turn on those notification bells and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye, guys.